the May 8th deadline to complete the project's deliverables has arrived and Sophie is happy to report to Arun that the product launch is ready. While it was a great deal of work and there were more than a few tense moments, it all came together in the end. Sophie knows, though, that this is not the end of the project. She remembers a project from a couple of years ago when she didn't pay enough attention to the closing activities and instead shifted her focus to a new initiative. The resulting problems were enormous. The operations personnel at Deco Productions struggled to understand and support the new product without her guidance. Not only did this detract from the success of her project, but it also caused some damage to her relationship with the operations managers. Chalking it up to inexperience, she resolved to never ignore the closing activities again. Checking the project schedule, she sees that three days of closing activities are planned. Her first priority is to ensure that the marketing department has all the information they need to effectively support this product launch. Pulling out her notepad, she jots down the following activities. Schedule a demonstration of the trade show products, e.g. the banners, holographic cards, multimedia demo. Schedule a presentation of the promotional video to the project sponsor and key stakeholders. Update the marketing department's documentation to reorder banner stands, holographic cards, murals, and tripods. Given these activities, she's confident that the marketing department will have everything it needs to successfully market the product.